Good boy. Um, the names of the puppies, the first litter is Harvey and Ray, and Ray is um, visually and hearing impaired. Um, and then the second litter is Polly, Wally, Ollie, and Denali, and they're all Collies. <laughs> and Wally of that litter is visually impaired. We had a family in the area that um, had two unwanted litters, unfortunately, and um, they knew that some other dogs were special needs and they brought them to us to, to do what was best for the dogs. And um, we knew as soon as we got them in and we saw what shape they were in, um, that we were gonna have to go to rescues for especially the two impaired ones um, because it would be very, very hard for an average family to care for them properly. Um, so I got on the phone and I called a rescue that we used for Collies previously. Um, unfortunately, they were not able to take the Collies, but they did help us get the word out and they got us connected with the rescues that are now taking all six of the Collies. Um, six, or three of which are going to Ohio and the other three are going to um, Indiana, Kentucky area. We're getting them ready to um, fly on a plane all the way back to Indiana. Um, what we did, we started actually two weeks ago getting them ready. We gave them their first puppy vaccinations. Um, yesterday, they all got spayed or neutered. We do have one little girl and five boys, so the little girl is a little more tender side than the boys. Um, and then today, we revaccinated them for their second set of puppy vaccinations. We also gave them their Bordetella shot. Um, and they got everything all set up. They're microchipped, and they're also getting 30 days of pet insurance through the shelter. We do have a volunteer who um, lives in the Indiana area who was contacted and offered to vol uh, voluntarily fly the dogs from Gadsden all the way back to his home and then to the rescues after they get settled for the night. They're going to spend the night with him and then um, go on to their, their new foster homes.